God, it's so much fun playing. I've been retired for quite a while now. Just received my eighth Grammy record of the year. I had six in a row. Every one of them was Zildjian's. Everybody came to Phil Spector dates because there was a big sign at Gold Star, the famous Gold Star Studios, and Phil Spector chose that studio. And there used to be, and Phil always worked like a lot of producers, very superstitious. Same night, Friday night, same studio, same microphone, same cymbals, the same drummer, the same everything had to be exactly as it always was. We did some amazing records together all those years with the Ronettes and so many of them, Darlene Love and all these wonderful singers, Cher, Sonny and Cher, uh, all that stuff, everything we touched turned to gold and we were very fortunate. And at one point there was a song called Be My Baby and somehow, and these were the very early days of rock and roll. Rock and roll was considered a very dirty word in a lot of circles. And there were a lot of great drummers, wonderful studio drummers that refused to play any kind of rock and roll. And we came along and we did a song for Phil that literally changed the drum world. And this song was an intro that I did. It might be buzzed a little bit, but it was simply, it was so simple, it was. But that intro, amazingly, started up my career. It really did start something in the drum world, and people fell in love with it. <laughs> 